Coinbase, ticker symbol C-O-I-N. So let's have a look at this name. So at the moment, May 15th, stock is up 8%, 220 bucks. That's where it's sitting. And recent highs, basically 52 week highs for the stock is 283. So what I'm watching from here for Coinbase, you can see on a daily chart, this is a daily chart of the stock. Uh, for the year and you can see we had a pretty big rally in January February into March and right now at the moment we are in this sort of a channel downtrending channel of course and this tech this stock can go either way it can break out push towards its 52 week highs or it can break down and come back down to its 200 day moving average so if we zoom out a little bit more um, I'll show you what is it doing in a larger scale so ever since it made it went public somewhere around 370 80 bucks so basically post IPO high was 429 that's the all-time highs after this big sell-off you can see very long consolidation throughout 2022 2023 finally broke out into the year end came tested that breakout level and this was the big move this year that we had so you can see the theme for the stock breaks out pretty pretty rapidly goes up and spends quite some time in a consolidation area breaks out very rapidly spends quite some time in a consolidation breaks out spends some time same thing we are at the moment uh, it depends again right if the rates if the yields for the bonds and if people basically run into bonds and the yields drop and some capital comes out of money markets and chase risky assets uh, you will see uh, this name attract buyers and maybe even squeeze some shorts if we get back above 250 and potentially 283 that recent highs can the stock go all the way to 350 to test these highs of uh, 2020 absolutely very likely very possible but we'll take a look at it in terms of options what's the probability of that happening let's say by election by the end of summer let's say and another thing I wanted to show you is a correlation with Bitcoin identical performance identical chart uh, at least for for this run-up you can see BTC so, sort of forming this flagging pattern where this flag if it does break out so the more volatile crypto uh, assets the more coinbase is going to make money right so and at the same time look at the BTC it could be forming bull, bullish flag or bearish. It can break out either way. It can break out of here. If it does get back above 70, 75K, you will definitely see Coinbase rally and join. And so far, it's it has been mirroring BTC. You can just lay it over this chart and take a look at both what they're doing. But here are the targets. Well, upside, we, we looked at it. But downside, I would be very bearish this stock if it slipped 192 like two days ago. It can definitely go test its 50 day moving average at the moment 234, 235 is pretty big resistance level. Look how many times it rejected, how many times it acted as a support. So it can certainly uh, go touch that level and then reject it. But if it does come back down to these two, 192 levels anytime soon, probability of, personally, that's my opinion, of this stock going to 160, in my opinion, very high because we are at the moment for the past two months or so in a downtrend for Coinbase. Unless it breaks out of this 240, then we would be talking about uh, the potential, I mean, squeeze. But right here, right now, um, there are too many variables to watch, right? You want 
also dollar to get hit you want more activity in crypto land uh, you want the bonds basically uh, yields to come down you want the BTC at the same time Bitcoin to rally so if we see all those things align yeah why not and probability let's take a look at the option activity what is it pricing in uh, let's go to June 12th uh, 21st which is next big option expiration it is implying that it can move 40 points up or down what's the probability of this stock by September 20th um, $350 call being in the money uh, that call is for September 20th 10 11 dollars put a big spread dollar spread according to IV probability of that strike being in the money 11 and a half percent but there's that much probability and that's whenever I'm buying an option outside of the money option contract outside of the money contracts uh, that's how much expectation I have because I trade a lot of times outside of the money puts and calls and yeah of course you you you, you try to make money you you try to buy something that you are highly convinced but right here right now if you're somebody who is betting to the upside I mean that's the probability at the moment right but again these things change daily very dynamic as price all over changes it will change but right here right now ultra short term neutral to still bearish coinbase but um, if you take a look at the ultra short term like 20 day uh, five day simple moving average stock back, back above it so which means you don't want to be bearish this unless it reaches its resistance of 240 and rejects that but so far it might have some legs but you can see there how many people are here are going to put pressure on this name if it does get back there very quickly so that's my uh, basically take that's my update for coinbase thanks for watching see you in the next one